we've got Minnie and Roger just wide of the goal mouth in case the ball's going wide. They'll try and pop it in. Jamaica between the sticks, and here comes Heather with a penalty. And, and uh, Charlie Chambers meets it, does well. And I think Doug, Doug Henderson clears it. Shane Chin back him up, does brilliantly, puts it in front of him. Dan Keating trying to get the backhand, does enough. Nice little angle on it. Nobody can really get to it. Shane Chin under the pony. Herb, Charlie Chambers. Charlie Chambers, Roger Soto. Roger gets a good backhand, but it comes back at him off Dan. Charlie Chambers pushes it forward again. Roger Soto's there, gets a backhand. Who's there? Heather. Heather going under the neck. Oh, she made a mess of that one. That's why it's dangerous. Adam couldn't quite make the most of it. Minnie clearing up, though. Minnie doing really well. Can she keep it going? She's got Dan Keating backing her up. Dan Keating pushes the ball forward. Shane gets a great backhand. Turning first, Doug Henderson, the number two for Jamaica. Doug still going. Roger Soto in defense, well backed by Roger. Now we have Adam and Heather riding each other off. Heather pulls up, gets the ball. Change in. I think I hear a whistle going. I think that's got to be against Heather for stopping on the ball, I would say, with Shane Chin coming down and Shane trying to get it. But again, I'm not the one with the whistle. Well, no, it looks like it's gone against the Jamaicans. And Dan Keating to take the penalty from the spot again. Jamaicans 30 yards from the ball. Here comes Keating. Oh, he's going at speed. He is going at speed. Is he going to try and get through the whole pack? Minnie trying to get rid of Shane. She does. Dan onto his own ball. Doug trying to get it. Dan's still going. Can he get it? Can he get it? No, it just runs out over the back line. He was just trying to back it with a little cut on it to get it back into the middle. Couldn't quite reach it in time. Hit in to Jamaica. Shane Chin to take it. Shane brings the ball in. Puts it past Minnie. He's got Doug Henderson running in front of him. Shane, great second shot from him. Bounces it off the boards. Heather's going to try and get onto it. Doug's trying to ride her off. Heather gets it good. Roger with a backhand. Lovely good backhand from Roger. Puts Jamaica again on the back foot. On the back foot is Adam. He's going for the backhand. Ooh, didn't quite get the shot he was looking for. Keating picks it up. Keating going towards goal. Adam having another go at a backhand. Doesn't really manage it. And, yep, I think that was a penalty against him as well. It was Keating's line. Adam had a chance on the near side, the left-hand side of the pony, but he crossed over the line to get it on the right-hand side of the pony and infringing Keating for doing that. And who's going to take this penalty from the spot? Unfortunately, it's inside the 30 yards, so it's an open goal penalty against Jamaica. They've got to be away from the goal mouth. One shot for the home team, the USA. I think Roger might be taking this. Roger at a trot. Probably the worst gate you could take the penalty out, but it doesn't matter. He puts it through the posts. Nine goals to five. It's going to make it a little hard for Jamaica to come back from this one. But, you know, we've said a goal a minute before, and we've been wrong before. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Jamaica can prove me wrong again by getting a goal a minute. In comes the ball. Keating and Shane Chin cancel each other out. Heather picks it up, puts it over the board. She's not happy with herself, but that's all right. So I think, that, as far as I can see, the main difference in this second half that Jamaica have done is they've taken Heather out of the game. But Minnie meets that from Shane Chin, a bit of an error from Shane. Shane's going to gallop at her. Minnie on the near side. What a shot from Minnie Keating. 
Are you kidding me, Keating? Oh, Shane Chin saves it. Roger Soto scores it. Oh, bad luck, Minnie. You absolutely made that, but Shane somehow got the backhand. Couldn't get any distance on it. And Roger was the first one to that second ball and puts it through. Double digits for the home team now, 10 to 5. Well played, Minnie Keating. A bit of an error from Shane there, really, to take that penalty too close to Minnie. And she made the most of it. Roger cleaned up. In comes the ball. Keating Sr. meets it. Trying to get to it. Oh, there's a lovely, powerful shot from Shane. I think it went over the boards. So this time we'll have a hit to the USA. Dan Keating to take it. The ball is behind him. He'll be good with that. And here comes Keating. Didn't really get a good shot, but he's going to get past uh, Charlie Chambers. Yes, he does. Shane Chin waiting in defense with Heather. Dan going through the middle. Keating. Shane realizes he's got to get there, but he's just going to shepherd it over the back line. Didn't want to make the backhand shot when he can have the ball put down out of a divot. It's flat, not bouncing, and he can get the forward shot. Here comes Shane. He is definitely my man of the match for the Jamaican team, is Shane Chin. He's been everywhere this afternoon. Heather was fantastic in the first half, as fantastic as Shane has been in the second. Be difficult to decide between the two. Who should be the MVP, Heather or Shane? And they're together right now. That's what they've been doing, fighting all afternoon. Shane wins it. And uh, Charlie Chambers turns onto it. Couldn't get the shot. I think Charlie's going to dig it out. There he goes. Nice little pop shot from him. He's got, oh, he's caught off it by Shane. Shane brings the ball up. He's got Doug Henderson in front of him. He gets the bouncing ball. Difficult shot. He makes the most of it. Now he taps it. Comes across the field. He's got control of it. He's looking up. Heather just covering. Shane, nice pass up the field by Shane. Dan Keating. Ridden out of it by Doug. Doug gets a good cut shot on it. Doug has another shot on it. Doug, please go in. No, it runs over the face of the goal. And a width of paint wide. So Keating for the hit in. Keating brings the ball. Oh, he doesn't. He leaves it. Jamaica attack. Charlie trying to get to it. Doug, oh, the whistle goes on him. I think maybe Dan might have fouled Charlie Chambers there. Probably a spot hit for Jamaica. Open goal because it's inside the 30. A chance for Jamaica to bring it a little closer. I don't think they're going to get there. They've only got a minute, eight seconds left, but. And Shane to take the open goal penalty. USA away from the goal mouth. Shane, simple shot. Makes it look very easy. There's quite a lot of pressure, though. Shane scores. Six to ten now. But the seconds are ticking away on Jamaica. But they fought brilliantly the second half. They definitely made a game of it. Shane and Heather take each other out. Dan Keating tries to get to a little tap round from him. He's hooked out of it by Adam. Minnie Keating backing him up, gets the shot. Heather, is this going to be Heather's shout for the MVP? She goes towards goal. If this goes, no, it's wide again from Heather. And that will end the match. And the chucker as the ball goes out of play after the seven-minute bell. 20 seconds of the overtime remaining. And USA run out the winners fairly comfortably, one would have to say, but I think the scoreline might flatter them a bit, 10 to 6. So they've won two years in a row now. And sweaty hand slappy time, so if you want to stand around the edge of the ground, the teams will come round and show their appreciation and sweat on you. How lovely.
All right, looks like Dan Keating is going to lead us off. I think he is riding Jack this chucker. Who's going to follow him? Mini Keating. And then Shane Chin. And then I think Doug Henderson. Heather Rasoulis, Heather Soto, Heather the Flying Heather. And then after Heather comes Adam Lang, Charlie Chambers, and last but not least, Roger Soto. Come and join us for prize giving momentarily in front of the David Patio Bar.